I'm gonna be very open and honest with you. For those who don't know, I'm not a fabricator. I don't know what I'm doing. Is it gonna stop me? Nope. Did I put too many marks on this thing? Yep. I screw up a lot. What's this for? Nothing wrong. I tried to do it the correct way and I failed. Woo. I'm doing it my way now. I have an idea. I'm not sure it's gonna work yet, but I'm gonna try. This is the original air cleaner off the motorhome motor. I need a part of it. Two carbs, two air cleaners. I think I learned my lesson last time though. I gotta get this thing out somehow. The hell is this thing anyways? I need tools. I'm guessing it's for emissions or something. We don't need that where we're going. Ow. There. You're just a clip. I win. No? Okay. This one's a little different. I think it'll be fine. Yep. Yeah. It'll be fine. Okie dokie. Fire! I know, it's excessive, but I don't have a plasma cutter. Whoa. Woohoo! That's hot. Smoking. Ooh, satisfying. Come on, cool off. You know it's cool off enough because the snow stops melting. That's the key. I'm thinking, I could be wrong, I don't know. I'm gonna try anyways. But what I'm thinking is this has a little curve to it. I don't know if you can see that or not, but it does, take my word for it. What if I can take my hammer and then it'll tap, tap, tap and go around here and flatten it out. I think it's gonna work. Well, it worked until it got there, but now it's kind of, kind. it's kind of flat, okay? It's just kind of. I'm not looking for perfection, don't judge. Look, I, I get it. Right now, it doesn't look like much. I understand. It's a couple of cut up pieces of car parts stuck on top of a couple of carburetors. I have a vision though. I can see it. Just wait for it. It's coming. It'll all come together in the end. Perfect. I, I, I hope. God, I hope. Can I make this happen? Is my vision possible? Well, that's not going to work. Yes. That's a zip tie. Pretend, pretend you didn't see it. It's fine. It's going to be fine. How am I gonna do this? I don't know. Think, Simon, think. Where's my tape measure? My filters are gonna be six and three eighths. So what's half of that? Three and two sixteenths? Isn't that just three and an eighth? I'm not good at this stuff. I don't know. Roughly there. Remember three inches. Here, I'll just write it down. Boy, I don't wanna screw this up. Let's get a better look. I have an idea. I think I know how I can do this. We'll see if it's right. That looks right, right? It should work. Missouri, you're first on the chopping block. How am I gonna cut this? How am I gonna cut this? Death wheel it is. I hope I can do this without wrecking the plate. Well, wrecking it any more than on purpose. Where did I put my gloves? I, I left them over there, I bet. Nope, I didn't. Don't worry. Found them. There. They were over here. Alrighty. What's the worst that can happen? Right? Right. Like it was made for it. I even kind of impressed myself on that one. Let's go. Don't you pinch too tight. For anybody that may be wondering what it smells like when you cut up an old aluminum license plate, because I would be, it has this weird boys gym locker smell. It's weird. It's not good. Gotta go deeper. I'm gonna test fit it. Get off of there. Test fit shows this, 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 that needs to go. 
You're right, I didn't show you. How many cameras do you think I have? We'll just do a little slice and dice. What is going on with this thing? So here's what I got cooking. Drill, rivet gun, rivets. I'm gonna just try attaching it to one side and then test it with the other one. Could I drill these up here and do it all up there? Yeah, but I would probably get crap in my carbs. So this is the way I'm choosing to do it. Ow. Do we want a little longer one in there maybe? Yeah. Yep, definitely. Will these rivets land right where the air cleaner's gotta sit? I hope not. Oh, yep. That bit is done for. There's one. Now, as long as I don't screw this up, I should be able to get this riveted on now, and it should just right onto the car. That's what I'm going with anyway. Oh, boy. I may have to go buy a new bit. It's not even drilling the hole. It's just popping through. Whatever. I'm gonna check it before I put this next one in. Just, just in case. I think it's fine. In fact, I know it'll be fine. Come on, baby, you got one more hole left in you? Maybe, come on, you're almost through. Get in there, no, get, get out of there. Perfect. That's the start of it. This is gonna be awesome. Here we go, moment of truth. Um, here we go. Moment, moment of truth. Yeah, there we go. That's the start of it. You're still looking at the zip tie, aren't you? Oh, I promise, I'm gonna fix it. My air filter showed up, woo! I almost threw this, there's still another one in there. Cause I need dose. Come on, yeah. Ooh, they sell chrome stuff too. Well, that's a problem. That'll be fine. Yep, that one's definitely gonna be fine. I think I'm just gonna go the death wheel and get rid of that piece. Oh, I should put them back in the plastic. Good thing I didn't throw that away yet. I need to decide if I wanna roll these edges, have it rounded, if I'm skilled enough to do that, because, <laughs> you know. Or if I just make a box. I don't know what the best answer is. What if we bend one and see what happens? That's a lot of bends and a lot of weird angles. I don't know how to do that. I think for simplicity, what if I bend one? Hmm. What to use, what to use. Maybe this will give me my shape. That look like center? It's close. Hmm. I don't know if that's gonna work. Car Craft Summer Nationals. That's kind of an antique around these parts. We don't have them anymore. Now it's Summer ma Street Machine Summer Nationals or something, I don't know. Something like that. We're gonna need more, but I think this is a good starting point. All right. I need to go get my drill bit anyways. I picked up a new drill bit. Hopefully this goes a little bit better. How far overlap do you think we want these? To the bottom of the letters? I don't know. Eh, it's good enough for me. If only I had another hand. How do people do this stuff? Oh, that's too tight. Come on, stop fighting. No, nope, don't do that. Maybe I just rivet it there and then I can take that off and rivet it there. Maybe? Is that too many? That looks stupid. It's moving. I'm losing it. Yep, that didn't work. Ah, I'm gonna try a different hair. We'll just try a regular old vice grip. See how that works. I better lap them the right way or I'll get jumped for that. Well, that's not tight enough. Oh, that's almost too tight. But we're gonna go with it. Oh, this new bit isn't a whole lot better. Are you effing kidding me? I'll be back. Oh. Hmm. Oh, there. Oh, yeah. They're hiding. Come here. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Let's try this again. Yeah. Junk. That's what it's supposed to do. Right there, people. Ah. All right, get up, let go, let go. Well, 
Well, this one's coming up a little short. It'll be fine. I'll make it up somewhere. Whoa. So much nicer. I don't know why I struggle. Probably doesn't need to be that tight. Now, ah, Minnesota. Make sure my overlap's right. Don't want to get in trouble again. Should be enough. I was praying I didn't catch my finger. Pretty close. Apparently the California plate's a little bigger than the rest of them. And this one may not be perfectly straight. Do I care about either of those problems? Absolutely not. Do you care about either of those problems? Yeah. There's the start of the top. This one was donated to me by a buddy of mine. This is a good spot for it. It took some massaging to get it kind of flat again. Not sure what he did with it. Is it a little rough? Yeah, I think it's awesome. Uh-huh. Yep, come on, work with me here. It's getting a little cumbersome here. Ah. There we go. I'm gonna extend this with another plate. Not sure if it's the right thing to do, but it's the thing I'm gonna do. Let's try and get it somewhat straight, huh? I don't try to screw up, it just happens naturally. Good enough. Okay, I'm just gonna stop. That's not working. Yep. Nope. Uh-uh. Looks like a two-year-old art project. Let me go cut this. Honestly, if you look right here, it doesn't look half bad. If you look over here, it's a different story. Does any of that matter? Nope. It's going underneath here, and I'm gonna be the only one that probably ever sees it. And it needs a little trimming. That's better. Damn, I even got it straight? I'm getting pretty good at this stuff. And then I see the first one and then I remember that I'm not. Yeah, you know how good I'm getting at this stuff? I put it on the wrong side. It goes on this end. Genius. I've got a template for the other side now. And then there were two. You should put under there, just perfect. Which you do. You did. Okay, you need a little trimming. Just to here. <sighs> back and forth, back and forth. Okay, I think we got something now. Did I make it a little, a little off center? I won't tell if you don't. So much easier, so much easier. It's gonna go like that. I think it's turning out all right. Next thing I gotta do is figure out a way to hold these down. Just keep, keep, just gotta keep grinding. Grind, grind, grind. Is it different? I've never seen it before. Has it been done before? Probably. Did I go by two different sizes of threaded rod and four wing nuts? Because I couldn't remember the size for the threaded rod for the, you know, the, what is it? The, air cleaner holder downer thing. Yes. Yeah, yes, I did. The win is I got the right size and I got wing nuts now so I can put another hole in and put the air cleaner on and we can start trying to get this all buttoned up and I can try and use those stupid rib nuts again. See if I can figure that out. Probably gonna come as a shock to some of my new followers, but I lost my other, my other one of these I made. I lost it. I don't know where the hell I put it. Oh, found it. It was, why didn't you tell me? I should just be able to drill right through the one into the other, right? It should be close to the same spot. I'm going with it. It'll be fine. It'll be just fine. Get some heat cranking in here. She's cold out today. Okie dokie. There's one. Ooh, I need the air cleaner. Whoa, there's two. I gotta cut that. What's gonna be the best way? I agree, it's a cutoff wheel. And then I could just run a little die down it and fix the threads, it'll be fine. I've clearly got this all figured out. Know exactly what I'm doing. Looks like right there. Nope. There. Yep. And then there were two. Get off of my head. Do I even have a die that goes this small? Ooh, I do. Which way is the right way? Does it matter? Oh, that didn't work. Come on. Let's, uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep. Come on, just be nice and start. 
Or be a jerk and don't start. What? Why are you doing that? How about I start at the other end and run it all the way down? Is that an idea? Okay, is it a good idea? Is it a doable idea? No idea if this is gonna work, but we're gonna try it anyways. Cut the threads all the way down and come off the backside or the top side, or we'll just spin out of the vice grip. Oh my God, why, why did you stop? I got room for error, which is how I figure things out. Probably not the ideal way to do it. What the hell? You know what I should do? I should just see if the wing nut will even go on there. Okay, well now I feel like a fool and I've wasted my time because that just went on perfect. <sighs> All right, I get this off. Yeah, I, and yeah, I got nothing. On the upside, this end's got nice clean cut threads. I hope I didn't screw up because that would be ironic. Is that ironic? Do you still go on this end? Perfect. I don't know why I wasted my time with all this. Stupid. Ooh, she is howling out there today. Ooh boy. Is this taking longer to make than it should? Probably. Did I make the holes a little extra big in case they weren't perfectly centered? Yeah. Oh, oh. that was close. I think that is gonna work. Are you liking it? I'm liking it. Basically gotta figure out how to mount this to this and make it look decent. Not sure how to bend things the way I want them to be bent. Do I just attach one side and then make the other side fit? Is that how I do this? I think I'm gonna mount the back and then figure out where I want the front. Yep, I think that's how I'm gonna do it. Is it the right way to do it? I don't know. Okay, so I'm gonna try and use these rib nuts. I got some that'll work, but I think there's plenty, plenty big. And I got plenty of bolts that I can use with them, but it doesn't tell me anywhere what size hole to drill for this stupid thing. So I gotta test. I think these are gonna look all right, if I can get it to work. That's a big if. All right, I'm gonna try this again. I did some searching in the Googles and I found out you need a 3 8 fit for this size rib nut and I had one. So I drove the hole in a piece of license plate. Yes, I took this apart too far trying to figure out how to get the other one out because I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, is that what they mean by that? Oh, that's what that's for. Well, that's how that works. I don't know what it's for. Then I should just go like that. Okay, that's cool as hell. That is, that is cool. Thanks to everybody that suggested to use these. I did it all by myself even. Other than everybody else telling me to get it and do it and use it and whatever. Where's my awesome rib nut tool? There it is. Open it up, put it on, thread it, insert, stay inserted and squeeze. I mean, come on. Is that not, I mean, it's cool. Is it not cool? I think it's, I think it's cool. Now I just need to stop it from acting like a cookie monster mouth. Rock, rock, rock. How high do we want it? Gotta have a little rake to it, right? I don't know what the right answer is. No, it's definitely gotta be up. It looks dumb down, it looks dumb. It's gotta be up. What if I just cut another license plate and put in there like a patch? Should be fine, right? Yeah, it'd be fine. Am I building this without even sitting in there to see if I can see over it? Uh-huh, yep, I sure am. How did I end up with so many Missouri plates? If I did something like that, I could tie these together and I could extend it out. How to do this, Simon? How do you do this? I don't know. fell just standing here. Yep, I think that's what I'm gonna do. Where's my marker? Should just keep this in my pocket, It'd be easier. A bit brisk out there today. Gotta turn the heat up a little bit. So do I attach it to that? Where did I put my gloves now? God, I need to clean this garage. That's too short. It's kind of a straight line. It's just a little wavy. Good enough for me. That is entirely too loose. I almost clamped this one right in. Good thing I took the rivets on that side. We'll fine tune as needed. 
Well, ah, there it is. Am I nervous about drilling right into my air cleaner? Absolutely. Is it bent properly and exactly where it needs to be? No, not even close. But they're thin aluminum, they'll be fine. I have that right where I want the rib nut, and then drill a pilot hole through both of them. I know exactly where both holes need to go. Seems smart to me. Remember which size hole I need to drill now? Ooh, am I scared I'm gonna get my fingers? Yeah, 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 I am. Yeah. I mean, it's mainly in there. We're going with it. Maybe I should put a rib nut back here. That'll keep it sucked down tight. Does it need to be solidly airtight? I don't know. And I can get one here. Yep, I like that idea. Definitely putting one there. I suppose I should take that all apart, put that rib nut in there, and bolt this side before I do the other side. I'm guessing that's probably the proper way to do it. So fine, I'll do it. Oh, I gotta, yeah. Duh, Simon, you gotta drill it off first. We're getting there. I'm pretty happy with how she's turning out. Some people might have issues with how there's crooked lines and uneven edges and stuff like this. It doesn't bother me. I think it adds character. It's not perfect, which is the way it needs to be. I gotta block the end off here. Yep, gotta block that end off yet. I have a plate for that that I think I'm gonna use, but we'll, we'll get to that after I get this done. Let me see. How am I gonna do this? Any ideas? I think we just go for it. What's the worst that could happen? I have to fix it again? <laughs> just goes to show, sometimes you just gotta hold your breath and go for it. Yeah, there's a lot of debris up there. This thing is awesome. So out here somewhere under this snow and crap in my junk pile is a bumper with a license plate on it that I want to put on that. So I got to find it fun. I'm hoping it's in this general area. Poor planning on my part. I get it. Found the bumper. I was going to bring it inside and do this. That seems like a lot more hard work than I want to do. brought some gloves with me. Yeah, I know, I'm a train wreck. Let's go back inside. Was it worth it? Yup. But I like it. Is it rough around the edges? Hell yeah. Does it have some imperfections? Of course. Is it slightly inappropriate? Obviously. It's it's perfect. I'm happy with the way it turned out. I've never seen one before. Doesn't mean they don't exist. Doesn't mean nobody else has already done it, but I've never seen one before. I gotta do some tweaking. I gotta, you know, overall, I'm pretty happy with it. I, uh, I don't claim to be any kind of big fabricator. I don't claim to have the skills that a lot of people out there do. I mean, there's some really talented people out there. I am not one of those people and I'm okay with that. I just wanna show people that you just gotta start doing it and figure it out as you go. Some of you are gonna love it. Some of you are gonna hate it. Absolutely hate it. And that's okay too. I don't care. If you wanna see some more, I got some more ideas. Comment, like, subscribe, hit that button for me. Appreciate it. Does it obstruct my view? A little, but I don't care. I think it'll be fine. I can always, you know, lean over and look around it. It'll be, yeah, it'll be fine.